Hi right, folks, welcome back to my uh, dangerous adventure. <laughs> we, uh, we've been through hell already. Uh, I didn't think that there would be this many difficult enemies all throughout the map, just right in front of me. Usually they, uh, most games try to keep all the difficult shit very spaced out from where you spawn, even Ark Survivor does that. Conan, though, I forgot, does not give a fuck. They will put even the most difficult creatures and dinosaurs, whatever you want to call them, even thralls. And player bases too, they will put that shit right in your face. Damn, so this game is definitely skill revolve. Ar Arc is more like, you know, do you have the most dinos? Do you do you have the best damage? Like do you have enough health to just tank hits and What the fuck? What the fuck? Isn't that the direction of that guy's face? The hell? Hey? Okay then. I'm kind of frightened. What the fuck? Is that a creature over there? It's like something right below my cross here. Weird looking. I right, see it. Well, I learned my lesson. Stay away from this island. <laughs> At least until maybe I'm level 60 and I got some uh, good pieces of metal lined up or something. But we managed to find some random noob that was sleeping out in the open, kind of like how I've been. So I was able to steal more stuff and now we're heading back home. As maybe someone stole my stuff too. Who knows? That's oh, a good thing that swimming doesn't take stamina. I think it did originally, though, know, and then after that, you had to swim slowly. So I know that, like, an arc, if you run out of stamina, instead of swimming slow, you just basically stop moving entirely. So it's increasingly difficult to, uh, do almost anything. I don't think you can attack in the water, can you? Let's see. Oh, it's, uh, oh, I see. So that thing is not your standard weapon then, okay. So let's go back to oh, back to this. And then she got some hard break though and a bunch of other shit with school. She even got herself a uh saber tooth kitten. Sneak. Alright. Let's see. Let me try to uh replace that sword. Two handed sword. Put the one handed there. It looks like you kind of can attack. It's not all that much, and you can regenerate salmon in a lot of its cool. It says like swimming is natural for Conan, I guess. Like stamina not being drained when the. This. It's neat. But I remember in the original Conan, uh, the first map, if you swim across the. Uh, Desert right before the jungle on the east side, uh, you would get uh, surprised attacked by a random fish that doesn't actually have the ability to attack you, which is rather funny. So it's like, ha, huh? get fucked. But yeah, if I'm ever worried about players, though, I can always like put myself under water. That's what I usually do when I'm doing my veteran things. But right now we're noobs, like I'm very open, like whatever happens. Seeing as uh, we're very open to things, I should probably put that two-handed sword on there. That way, in case if I get into a big fight, we have a big weapon that I can slice and dice with. And I think that's actually the move set I was somewhat used to. Yeah. Also, since we're not gathering in the moment, we can also repair my uh, other thing, weapons and such. Yeah, this is what I usually do is uh, I maybe keep a couple gathering tools on hand and the rest of it is just PvP, PvP, PvP. Uh huh. And this game's uh, PvE is very close, like intermingled with the uh, PvE. So, like, oh hey, there's a, there's a nice little waterfall thing over here. It's neat. Huh. I might check it out before we leave, you know, you never know, there might be, uh, some person sleeping in there. 
But I mean, worst comes to worst, it might be a person who plays already and quite a bit less. So let me actually just get a crafting tool on hand. Uh, let's put this with that shitty sword. Yeah, let's fuck that. Did I get a level? I did, I think, but no, no points. Yeah, we'll get that ability soon to uh, move well over and cover it a little bit. Oh, we're level 15 now? Yeah. So, I'm gonna try to imitate my stats. Another thing I can do is maybe hop on 3 or 1 or 4 real quick and see what kind of stats I got. So I have no idea. And even if my guy's been kidnapped or all my loot has been robbed, my character's stats should still be the same. Nonetheless, we're, we're always able to respawn. It's part of the game. Well. I think in the next hour, though, PvP, uh, Demolition is on. Could mm -hmm. put a piece of light armor. I would love to. I cannot. Not right now. But no, good news is that we got a lot of food, we got some water, got fiber, and uh, other stuff that I first had, so... We're walking away with a good amount of shit. So that's cool. So... <coughs> Thank you, fellow noob. <laughs> yeah, thank you for not paying attention to your game. <laughs> Otherwise, we probably would have had to fight for that a little bit. A little bit, not much, so. Yeah, hopefully we get enough stamina later on, too. Hey. Usually, once I hit max level, I, I feel a lot better about uh, the way I play. Or, like, I know what skill point. Oh, oh okay. Just a baby bear. Let's actually take him. Ah, black eyes, huh? Well, that's interesting. That's such easy access to it, too. Huh. I'm supposed to go into cold areas usually for that. Huh. This will explain why we see some pretty heavy duty bases throughout the area. Interesting. Uh, but yep, yeah, now we gotta try to, uh, yeah. climb on top of this shit. Hopefully there's no, like, crazy traps or anything weird. And what I need to do is, uh, I need to, like, hug the wall a little bit in a minute here. And then scoot over to that base. For now, let's just try to get on top of this. With my very minimum stamina. <laughs> Good job, buddy. Now, if I would've set the fall in the river, though, we would've encountered this anyway. Also, some of these guys actually really stack up on fish. Especially when there's uh, lakes like this, because, you know, you may not see the fish, but when they have fish nets, they have, like, thousands of food. It's crazy. Okay, so now we're in. So what's in here, man? Do tell. Or is it just pure fucking foundation and that's it? Because that's the kind of vibe I'm getting from it. Honestly, it looks more of a area like a, a watchtower, maybe. Oh, there's the mama bear. Huh. So yeah, if I make an animal pen tonight, I might be able to raise both of these animal thralls, possibly. Oh shit, that thing really wants to go to me. I mean, this person basically gave a bridge to this fucking bear for killing me. But I ain't going around that. Nope. Unbearable circumstances. Whoa, oh boy. You discovered Traitor's Falls. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, so that's what this thing was. Okay. Cool. Very, very interesting. But yeah, in the past, like, even if I was wearing cloth gear, I could handle, uh, even Silent Legion people in Defend Armor. I would definitely be killed a lot easier, squishier, too. But, uh, if we have that ability to where I can roll while over encumbered, this means I can gather, but I can still fight. It's like someone can try to do, like, some crazy slash fest, and I just go roll right behind them and be like, HA! Dark Souls backstab! Oh. oh, my girlfriend tried calling me. Shit. Hi, you've reached my 
my voicemail and now they're able to Yeah. I checked that. that message one minute too late. I was from like 522 and that was like right when I was running away from fucking demon things. And I usually have my sound notifications off because otherwise Discord groups and TikTok shit will be pudding, pudding. And if I think everything is important, then yeah. I even left like uh, I was in like 20 plus Discord groups for years, and I only just now left them. Crazy. <sighs> I, I kind of feel like I'm an asshole. <laughs> But at the same time, though, I mean, she just kind of popped up out of nowhere, like, oh, hey, I'm, like, doing my GPS, calling out, uh, yeah. And I see four fucking calls. It's like, Jesus, woman. You know. Like, what, what if I'm playing a game, or what if I'm t you know, talking to my dad, or taking a shit? Like, you want to hear me go, <laughs> you know. Give me a better warning than fucking Discord. Like, uh, oh, there we go. Nom nom. There we go. Hi, you jerk. <laughs> I, I was actually just teasing myself. Oh really? Yeah, I was like, I was like, how dare I? Yeah, how dare you? Hmm. <laughs> 